The Jayhawks of Kansas face the team that's picked to be number one in the nation, the Tar Heels of North Carolina. The address announcer now is going to introduce the players from both teams. And here's number 35, that is David Magley, a forward out of South Bend, Indiana, senior for Kansas. And here is James Worthy, number 52, a junior out of Gastonia, North Carolina, for the Tar Heels. Out comes Jeff Dishman, number 20, a junior out of Medicine Lodge, Kansas. And at the other board, there is Matt Doherty, a sophomore out of East Meadow, New York, for Carolina. Number 24 for Kansas is Kelly Knight, injured all last year, a six foot seven center out of Salina. And Sam Perkins, a sophomore out of Latham, New York, for the Carolina Tar Heels, who was the rookie of the year of the ACC a year ago. Now going to backcourt, here's the preseason All-American, Tony Guy, a 6'6 six, six senior out of Towson, Maryland. He makes things go. And the man who helps make this thing go for the Carolina Tar Heels, starting his first game ever, Mike Jordan, out of Wilmington, North Carolina, a freshman, big starting assignment. Number 25 is Lance Hill out of Baltimore, a junior. And here's the man, the point guard, Jimmy Black, the senior of the Bronx, New York, for the Tar Heels. So the introductions have been made. Tonight can't get it, so Guy's going to take the shot. It is no good, and there is Mike Jordan with his first rebound ever. And now he tries to have an assist for Ruby and does. And they're calling a foul on number 25, Lance Hill. Jordan, the freshman, started the fast break, has the assist, and Worthy scores. There's Jordan with a good bounce pass. James Worthy fakes baseline, and there's a chance to test the movable rims. It takes 230 pounds of pressure to bend that, Jesse, and he did. And it's just really tight in that zone. Almost everybody is in the lane. They're really going to test uh, to see whether without Pepper. Jordan's first shot. It is no good. Pulled down by Dishman. With well, their experience of last year, Carolina's only starting one senior. Still a little tough, and that's the man with the ball now. Black getting it across to Jordan, the freshman. Jordan goes up and drops it through, and there is the first basket for Carolina. It's 4-2. Jordan draws his first personal foul, and the freshman goes out, and Jim Braddock, a junior out of Chattanooga, Tennessee, very strong, comes in. It's interesting they came for Mike Jordan very quickly. It looked like he was breathing a little heavy. It's certainly not conditioning. It's his first start as a freshman, and so many things have been said about him, comparisons to Walter Davis and David Thompson in this part of the country. That's, uh, that's pretty heavy metal for a, a youngster of 18 years old. He is talented, and he really is kind of going against the system. Dean Smith normally doesn't start uh, even the most talented of freshmen, uh, but this year he is. In fact, Perkins, it took him half a year and an injury last year to Pete Budko for him to make the starting lineup. Lance Hill gets two shots. Jordan remains in the ball game. They love him, as Bucky said, a lot of pressure on him. Outstanding freshman. What a way to start, not only his first game, but against the defending Big Eight champions. Black tries to get something going to Bradford. He must stop. Perkins, Black, Worthy. Worthy's going to take the shot. And run. 11 points for Worthy. 27 all, 556. Up to God. Over to Hill, who's loose, will take it to the basket. Knocked away by Worthy. The ball was on its way up, not down, not goaltending. Darty feeds it off to Worthy, can't get it. Mike Jordan has four points. Carolina's got the lead by two. Even though there's less than two minutes, if Carolina gets another break like that, Ted Owens will call timeout. Kansas in the familiar. 2-1-2. Two, two. Jordan, the freshman, getting added. Poison confidence puts it in. Now has six points. 37-34. Magley, Barlow is on him. Magley will have to calm things down here a bit. They've got the time with 104 to go. Guy puts it up. Wow. He was fouled by Jordan. And for Mike Jordan, that's his third. Guy puts an awful lot of pressure at 6-6 with that ball. Watch now. He comes in, plants the feet. He gets at the free throw line, gives the good ball fake. Gets Jordan, the rookie, up in the air, and it really kind of glides in there. He knows he's got the foul. Now it's a question of whether he's got the three-point play. That's a senior against a freshman. University of North Carolina picked number one in the nation by no less than three different polls, 37, and Kansas picked not even in the top 20, 37. It's a tie. Looking at the North Carolina team stats, uh, Worthy with 11 points, Perkins with 10, no surprise there. 
Uh, Jordan, three for six from the floor, a good uh, shooting percentage for a rookie, but he does have three personal fouls and is the only man in the game in foul trouble. Worthy to Darty, who just does not miss often, but does there. Whistle. Jordan is fouled as he goes up. Hauser turns around and says it's number 24, Kelly Knight. Darty off the rim. On the other side, Wayne Jordan, a jumping jack, gets a piece of that ball, keeps it alive. Not a shooting foul. It is the third foul on Kelly Knight. Perkins. Black Jordan in the corner. The freshman hit. Eight points for Mike Jordan. Out of Wilmington, North Carolina. 41 all. And Summers. Under threw it away again for Jordan. That's two mistakes for him. Gordy is fouled, and I believe by Summers who was having an awful time since replacing Kelly Knight. Ahead by that much before, not in this game. Jordan gets the ball in, out the open, Worthy! 13 points, James Worthy, 53-47. Corner, he's a good shooter, he's proven that today. This is the starting team for North Carolina that's made this surge, and they've been rested. Jordan, the freshman, yes sir! He has 10 points and this is initial start. 57-49. For Carolina's playing tough defense. Kansas can pull within four. And they throw the ball and Worthy when he try to throw it across court. Nothing good happens. Look at Worthy! Oh! Showtime! Doherty's up along the bench for Carolina will be coming in. Here's Doyle that we told you about. Not going to take the shot. It is taken by Martin off to the side and Mike Jordan. Boy, you can see this freshman grow up in this game. The way he went up for that, Black feeds to Brust. They call blocking or charging, and they're going to call blocking. He's got to remember he's got time, takes the shot. That's a bad shot with nobody down court. He did have time, about a minute and 20 seconds, only six points down, and he took a poor shot. Well, it's hard to fault him, though. He's had such a hot hand, and he put up a few like that that went. I think uh, Kansas should be fouling uh, uh, Mike Jordan, the freshman now. This is, this is one area where his inexperience might show. Jordan's getting away scot-free. He's got the ball now, and that's Guy all over it. But they're letting Jordan go to the basket. And there was a foul on the way into the basket. Jordan was fouled, but that's not the way they wanted to foul him. Good acceleration. Jordan taking it in. Everybody had a shot at him. If he's a little bit shaky on his free throw, I think we can look for Kansas to grab him a lot. Dean Smith directing traffic. Jordan to the foul line for the first time. Well, his inexperience did not show there, did it? He now has 11 points. Ted Owens, his team gave the good fight till with 13.50 to go. Kelly Knight went out and down went the Kansas Jayhawkers. 70 to 63 with 51 seconds to go. And Jordan hits both. And down comes Peacock. Well, that's it. Never got the ball across the 10-second line. 74 to 67, the final score. Yeah. Well, let us, what do you think of Mike Jordan? Well, freshman. Well, people are comparing him to Walter Davis and David Thompson. He really is a good player, and under a lot of pressure today, I thought he performed. He's an extraordinary athlete. He's a better guard at this point than Thompson was, and he's certainly not the shooter that Walter Davis was. He's going to be a great one, and he has shown me that thoroughbred something that, that responds to pressure because this was a big game. All right, I'm Jim Simpson for Bucky Waters. Our first game of the year has been a great one.